I just got done watching the Multiverse of Madness, and uh, I don't know what to say. Uh, it was incredible. The CG uh, was amazing. The there's a, a ton of crimson purple smoke in this movie. That's uh, well, it's actually cranberry. It's really really bright, but there's some purple smoke too, yeah. and it's all really 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 rich and deep in color. It's incredible. Yeah. Everything was great, uh, but there weren't enough effects. There just weren't enough effects uh, when we watched the 40x version. So we brought our own orange spray. And sprayed it all over the theater. Then some demon ghost woman appears out of nowhere acting cute saying that she is the special effects and we can't do special effects. Then tries to attack us in front of everyone. So we walk off and then she attacks us some more. So we run off as she throws herself around and acts like somebody should give a shit. Yeah. Weird. I guess the movie was so good she couldn't handle people having that much fun. That was what it seemed like. Yeah, you gotta stick around. There's a scene with the hot dog man that's featured in the movie, which I thought was a, a great cameo by uh, classic, you know, uh, Bruce Campbell. Yeah. Wow, I remembered his name. Uh, <laughs> Bruce Campbell? I believe that's his name, right? Is it? No. That's not his name. There's no way. I, I'll look it up, but I believe that's his, his name. The guy who uh, stabs at the book of evil faces? No, the, the hot dog man. Yeah, that's him, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, that's not his name. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Anyways, the, there's awesome scenes. They do a better tentacle fight uh, than other movies. That's all I gotta say. Yeah. Not gonna mention. You, you'll know what movie it is when you see it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, there was no orange portal acid smell, so we we brought some food grade, natural, non sticky, just acid that is like you know just a disinfectant, better than bleach. Yeah, that's good stuff, and uh, I guess we disinfected them. There was great cranberry smell. There was great um... Kransky smell exploding. Yeah. Every, dude, everybody's gonna tell you that. It's not a, It's not even a secret. They just like John Kransky's stupid mug going splug. I don't know. So something about it. I don't know. Anyway. <laughs> yeah, I guess it addressed a lot of people's fears that, that the Illuminati is looming over their life because Doctor Strange and the multiverse of cartoonness, you know, got into that brain space and made it a little more, you know, like... Accessible. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I'm just glad that it didn't go on too long. It got kind of boring there for a little bit, but it, it wasn't too long. Well, because of the Illuminati. All I gotta say is, I always talked about it and said I wanted to see it, and it's incredible that they implemented a, like, entire scene where there's, like, an eclipse in it in a dramatic way. Yeah. And that's awesome, too. That was nice. Yeah.